Hi guys, so it is currently 12 p.m. It's Sunday. It is also T minus five days until Christmas, which is literally insane. And it is also Vlogmas Day 20, which is clearly blowing my mind. I didn't really vlog yesterday. I don't think I actually like talked. There's probably like some B-roll and maybe you're like really confused. I didn't really do anything yesterday. I did paint my nails and they are kind of this like abstract kind of thing. I wanted to do something different. I'll insert the picture that I found on Pinterest of what I was trying to uh, recreate create but other than that I really didn't do anything yesterday usually around this time we see a bunch of like our family friends and family and we drop off or like we give them like presents for Christmas so this year obviously we can't do that because we are in a lockdown so we just drove around and like dropped off presents and that is basically all I did yesterday really nothing interesting happened the highlight of my day was literally painting my nails so and I also painted them at like 10 p.m. because that's when I typically paint my nails. But one of my friends just dropped off something and I wanted to share it with you guys because I am so excited. So my friend Lily actually started a clothing line called Boy. I'm gonna leave her handle right over here. And she made a sweatshirt and I bought it. She packaged it up so nicely. Oh my god. It's so cute. So the brand is called Boy. I don't know if you guys can see that right here. Oh, it's so cute. I'm a sucker for good packaging. I'm so excited. So on the collar, it says, I was made for you. Like how freaking cute is that? So this is what it looks like. It just says Boy on it. Is the inside soft? The inside is so soft. I love when it's like the fleece inside. I don't normally get white sweatshirts because they always tend to get dirty, but I'm going to be extra careful with this. I do know that she sold out, which I'm so proud of her. She sold out of her first drop. We will just have to wait until the next one drops. So today I have, again, nothing planned. I do have to start making like holiday cards though, which kind of sucks. Hi guys. So it is four days until Christmas. The countdown to Christmas begins now. It is also Vlogmas day 21. Last night I went to bed at like 8 30. I had a glass of wine even though I was already tired. Something about me is that every time I drink wine I feel so incredibly like sleepy. So I went to bed like super early. I have no regrets because I'm still actually kind of tired now. Every time I pick up my vlog camera, I swear I like forget what I wanted to say. Like I had so much to tell you guys that I just can't remember now. Oh, I do. I have a story time. I feel like it's every day new hinge story. I matched with this one. No, I. Okay. This guy had a prompt on his hinge profile that was like, his answer was, I'm an identical twin. I responded with, so are you the better looking one or is your twin the better looking one or something like that? Yes, I did say that on these apps. I really don't give a fuck. So I am so freaking bold and I don't really care. We were like talking and then I left him on red because of something that he said, look at me, I'm rhyming. So I left him on red and then I matched with this other guy and I was like talking to him. So I replied to him and the guy that I ghosted, both of them at the exact same time said the exact same thing. So either they know each other. Anyways, both of them are fucked. I am now ghosting both of them because they suck but I just thought that was weird like if you're friends at least like make it less obvious that you guys are together messaging at the exact same time the exact same thing please be original what I realized from being on this these things is um none of these guys are original guys if you are watching this do better you guys are not original it's kind of sad it's super easy to just message anyone and don't do that do not message everyone let me give you a couple rules. These are just what works for me. If this doesn't work for you, then take this with a grain of salt. Number one, let them message you first. Do not message anyone first because if you message first, 95% of the time they are creepy and they do not want a conversation. I'll let you interpret that the way that you want. Number two, set your deal breakers because there is a way to set your deal breakers and please do it because it filters out just everything that you do not need number three do not be afraid to ghost people if you are getting ghosted do not be afraid to ghost people because you don't owe anyone anything 
and you are a bad bitch. Also, I've gotten really good at finding people on Instagram, so watch out. Hi, you guys. So it literally looks like I haven't moved because I am still very much in my bed. It literally looks like I haven't moved all day, but I promise you I did. I moved to the couch. All I did today was watch The Crown. I'm obsessed with that show, even though they're the storyline is kind of hard to follow, but I'm obsessed with it. Very determined to finish the entire series. Today it was announced that the entire province is going into lockdown as of Boxing Day. So December 26th, the entire province is going back into lockdown and it very much feels like the first lockdown where everything just completely shuts down. Non-essential businesses are not allowed to open. Schools are remaining closed until I believe January 11th for elementary students and then January 25th for high school students, which blows my mind because I still think that schools should have been kept closed this entire time and they should not have even opened. And I think that it is completely stupid that they are still going to open when they can very much learn remotely and learn online. I just don't see the correlation in keeping schools open when a lot of the cases are linked to schools. I don't know if they just don't want to admit that they're wrong and they don't want to shut down schools or what, but I still very much think that they should. Today, as I said, is Vlogmas Day 21, meaning that it is December 21st, which I found out on TikTok is a good day for manifestation. I actually want to find that TikTok. So I watched this TikTok. I'll put it right over here. Today is called the Great Conjunction and it is, I don't know a lot about like astrology and like any of that, but it is, but regardless, it is a good day to manifest and do like a whole list of manifesting. And I personally very much believe in manifesting. You can call it God, you can call it the universe, you can call it fate whatever you call it. I have always loved to journal. I like to get my thoughts out. And apparently it is good to manifest the next few years. So I am going to spend the next like hour or so jotting down my manifestations and I will do a time lapse for you guys and then I will share them with you guys. Not all of them because some of them are probably going to be personal and I want to hold that as like a little secret with myself in the universe. Okay, so I just finished my The Great Conjunction Manifestation list, specifically to be written today. I hope you guys saw the same TikTok that I did and you are manifesting today as well because I know when this gets uploaded, this day will have been long gone. So I hope that you took advantage of the Great Conjunction. There's a couple things about me hitting milestones on my YouTube channel. I wanted to cover a lot of aspects of my life. So there's everything from my YouTube channel to Instagram to my relationships to my family members, things like that. So I look at this as things that could happen within the next year and I also create a time frame for that. But there are also things in here that will happen within the next five, ten years. So I'm thinking ahead because I wanted to also manifest for those years as well. 
good morning guys so it is currently 9 20 in the morning i'm so sorry if it's like really loud there are like people doing construction so hopefully you guys can't hear too much of that um it is vlogmas day 22 so there are three days until christmas i have not finished making christmas cards yet so i'm gonna do that first thing just to get it out of the way i think that's all i really wanted to do today i'll probably watch a couple youtube videos while i am doing it i was hoping today would be brighter it looks pretty bright because i'm literally standing beside a window but it's actually pretty kind of dark it's been super gloomy it's also gonna be like a snowstorm on christmas and then on boxing day as well also i'm waiting for a package from golden blooms which is like my new favorite small business jewelry company from toronto Hey you guys, good morning. I literally just got out of my bed. Um, my hair, oh my god. It is currently like 9.30 in the morning. If you can hear that, my sister I think is making cinnamon rolls. I could be very wrong. What the hell is going on with my hair right now? Today is Vlogmas day 23, which December 23rd is actually my like favorite day before Christmas because I consider it to be like my Christmas Eve because my family does most of our Christmas festivities on Christmas Eve and then considering this year we are in lockdown we can't really go and see like my extended family so like my cousins and my aunts and stuff I'm gonna fix my hair situation Hey guys so it is very dark i also changed into this sweater from my friend's clothing line because i got matcha on my other sweater that i was wearing so i immediately put like stain remover on it and now it is soaking and my wrist just cracked i am aware yesterday i finished finally making the christmas cards and i don't think i showed you so i want to show you now i make christmas cards for both my sisters and then my sister's boyfriend but this year i also wanted to make one for my sister's boyfriend's parents because they always give us a card so i wanted to give them one as well i'm gonna show you the ones that i have i usually don't do a theme <laughs> they're usually just always kind of funny because 2020 inevitably sucks um, i decided to go with a the theme of 2020 so the first one is a stocking for 2020 filled with coal and then it says better luck next year 
Merry Christmas. Uh, the next one is How 2020 Felt and it's a melted snowman. Then it says Merry Crisis, you know, from like that vine. Um, then I crossed it out. I don't know if you guys will be able to tell, but then I said Christmas. I crossed it out again and I said no crisis because 2020 was tragic. This one I saw on Pinterest and it's oh quarantine tree, oh quarantine tree. And the tree is made out of toilet paper. For my sister's boyfriend's parents, this one I am really proud of. This one is two snow globes. They are six feet apart. I indicated it right there and it says Merry Christmas from our bubble to yours because they are snow globes. And I was really proud of this one. Also, my golden blooms order is supposed to come today and I'll show you that whenever it decides to arrive. I swear the sun sets at like 2 p.m. But my package from Golden Blooms finally got here. She wrote me a cute little note. This is so freaking cute. A handwritten note. If you want like really good quality pieces, I highly recommend you go and check her out because she's like the sweetest human being ever. They come with stickers. And then this is how it comes. It comes in one of these dust bag things. And I got the Atlas chain, which just looks like this. It's one of those just like thin curb chains, and I've been looking for one. But the one on Missouri is so freaking expensive. And actually, this one is a better material. The one from Missouri is actually gold vermeil versus this one that is gold fill. And I got the 18 inch just because I believe my necklace right now is like a 15 and a half or like a 16 inch. So I wanted something that was longer. Okay, so hopefully this gives you a better idea of what it looks like. It's just a thin curb chain and then my custom necklace that I got from her just says my last name and it's really super dainty as well. All oh, these look so good together. Hi you guys, good morning. It is 9 o'clock in the morning. Happy Vlogmas Day 24. Today is actually the last day that's going to be included in Vlogmas Week 4. Me and my family typically open Christmas presents on like early morning Christmas Day after we go to church. But of course we can't do that this year, so we're watching it online. Okay, good. <laughs> Man, I knew I should have got it to the white one. Oh, you already opened it? 
No? There's a minute. Wait, 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 wait. What is this? What is this? <laughs> Why is it so squishy? What is it? What is it? <gasps> My son! <laughs> Your what? <laughs> Her nail swatches. <laughs> Stupidness. Oh my god, there's so much tape. This is almost extra small. Why is it big? Because it's oversized. Oh my god, why are you such an ass? You're one of those people. At least I didn't wrap it as a swing. <laughs> read it, read it, read it. Yeah. You bitch. Oh, what is it? Yeah. Read the card, read the card, read the card. <laughs> You're so rude. <laughs> is it my necklace? Ew. Wait, where's the opening? Oh, here it is. Ooh, it's the chain. It's the one that I wanted. Thanks, Nana. Yeah. Book. A book. book. Yeah, I order on Amazon. Nanya. She's so annoying. Ah! Is it really this or is it <laughs> something no, else? It's some jewelry box that I got my uh, ring. Is it actually that's so <laughs> rude? Yes. What is it? What is it? Is it one earring? <laughs> <laughs> it's one earring. Oh, no. Yes. Which one is that yes. for? The set? Yes. Yes. Order his thing. Okay, stay there. Oh, big one, big one. It's just a box. Ooh, is it actually a receipt? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. Mm. 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 Matching hoodie! Matching. Oh, I guess so. You can still return it. Do you want to return it? Matching. Oh, I guess so. Matching. Do they give you the when gift return? Sweatpants. <laughs> I think I got them together. But I don't have the track. I wear these the... tomorrow. You get an email, I think. Gift return. I'll be wearing these tomorrow. <laughs> <laughs> Hi you guys and Merry Christmas. This setup is going to look pretty familiar from my last video because you were seeing this video after that one. But I am here to officially end Vlogmas, officially end Vlogmas Day 24, even though today is Christmas. I am here to end Vlogmas Week 4. I am here to end Vlogmas 2020. We did it. Today is Christmas and I know that I said I was going to end it yesterday, but I just didn't. I'm here to end Vlogmas for 2020. I hope you guys enjoyed watching what I get up to for Vlogmas, the lead up to Vlogmas. I don't even remember really what I vlogged this week. Everything was just kind of a blur so i hope you guys enjoyed watching i'm about to film my what i got for christmas 2020 so if you haven't seen that video because this vlog is going out after that one so i will link it in the cards above and if you want to watch it you can watch it i am so thankful for each and every one of you this video that you are seeing is actually being uploaded on december 31st new year's eve so by the time you're seeing this we have officially made it to the end of the most tragic year 
2020. So if you made it this far into the video, this far into the year, but you guys were the highlight of my year and I can't thank you guys enough for the amount of support, the amount of love, every single comment, every single like, every single view. I thank you so much and I hope that we will continue to grow this community. I hope you guys enjoyed Vlogmas. I hope you will stick around with me into 2021, into 2022. I have some exciting videos planned for the top of the year, so subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. Follow me on Instagram. I am the most active on Instagram. It's just at Gabriel underscore, and I will see you in 2021. Bye, guys.